Did you know that there are eight different species of bears living across various habitats around the world? From the icy realms of the Arctic, where the formidable polar bear reigns, to the dense bamboo forests of China, home to the adorable and quirky panda bear, these creatures are as diverse as the landscapes they inhabit. Bears have been a source of fascination for centuries, captivating us with their raw strength, remarkable intelligence, and surprising gentleness. They feature prominently in our stories and myths, symbolizing everything from courage and power to wisdom and solitude. Among the eight bear species, each one boasts unique characteristics and adaptations that allow them to thrive in their specific environments. The grizzly bear, for instance, is known for its sheer size and strength, while the sloth bear, a native of the Indian subcontinent is recognized by its shaggy coat and long, sickle-shaped claws, ideal for digging up termites, its preferred snack. Then we have the elusive sun bear, the smallest of the bear species, named for the golden crescent on its chest. It is a master climber, spending much of its life high up in the trees of Southeast Asia's tropical rainforests. And let's not forget the spectacled bear, the only bear species native to South America, easily identifiable by the distinctive light markings around its eyes. Yet despite their differences, all bears share certain traits. They are mammals, they belong to the family Ursidae, they have large bodies with powerful limbs, they possess sharp claws and strong jaws, and they are, for the most part, omnivorous, though the extent of their carnivorous tendencies varies by species. Today, we're delving into the world of these fascinating creatures exploring their habits, their quirks, and their incredible adaptations. We'll also look at the challenges they face in the modern world, and what we can do to help protect them. So stick around as we embark on this unbearably interesting journey into the world of bears. While we often picture bears as fierce hunters, most bear species have an omnivorous diet. Yes, you heard that right. Bears, despite their intimidating presence and reputation, have a rather diverse palate. Their diet includes a variety of foods, ranging from berries, grasses and roots to fish, insects, and even the occasional mammal. This dietary flexibility allows them to adapt to a variety of habitats and make the most of the resources available. Let's take a moment to talk about the grizzly bear, or as some like to call it, the North American brown bear. This powerful creature is known to enjoy a mixed diet. In spring, grizzlies primarily feed on emerging vegetation and scavenged carcasses left over from the winter. As summer arrives, they switch to a diet rich in berries, insects, and fish, especially during the salmon run. On the other end of the spectrum, we have the giant panda. This bear species stands out for its unique diet. While most bears are omnivores, the panda is a dedicated vegetarian. Its diet is almost exclusively composed of bamboo. In fact, pandas can spend up to 12 hours a day eating, consuming up to 28 pounds of bamboo. Their bodies have adapted to this unique diet with strong jaw muscles to crush tough bamboo stalks and a pseudo-thumb to grip bamboo shoots. And then, we have the polar bear. Living in the harsh Arctic, these bears primarily feed on seals, using their remarkable hunting skills to catch their slippery prey. Unlike their brown bear cousins, polar bears are more carnivorous due to the scarcity of vegetation in their icy habitats. So, next time you think of bears, remember they might just be looking for a berry bush, not a fresh catch. Their diet is a testament to their adaptability and survival skills. Whether it's a grizzly bear munching on berries, a panda feasting on bamboo, or a polar bear hunting seals, each bear's diet tells a unique tale about its lifestyle and habitat. Bears are famous for their hibernation, but do you know how long they can go without eating, drinking, urinating, or defecating? It's a question that has fascinated scientists for years. The answer is truly astounding. Bears can go into hibernation for up to seven months without consuming anything at all. Yes, you heard it right, seven whole months, but what exactly is hibernation? Well, it's a state of inactivity and metabolic depression in animals characterized by lower body temperature, slower breathing, and lower metabolic rate. Hibernation helps animals conserve energy during harsh or scarce conditions. Bears, particularly those living in colder climates, are renowned for this unique ability. As winter approaches, they start consuming large amounts of food, storing fat to sustain them through the long sleep. Once they've tucked in for their long winter snooze, their heart rate slows down and their body temperature drops slightly, just enough to conserve energy, but not so much that they can't wake up if danger presents itself. What's even more incredible is that during this period, bears don't lose muscle mass or bone density, a problem that plagues many animals during periods of inactivity, including humans. 
Scientists are studying bear hibernation in hopes of finding solutions to human health issues such as osteoporosis and muscle atrophy. Moreover, female bears have another surprising ability. They can give birth and nurse their cubs during hibernation. Yes, while in the depth of their wintry slumber, a mother bear can welcome new life into the world, nurturing them until spring arrives. All these adaptations are part of a complex survival strategy developed over millions of years. They allow bears to live in some of the harshest environments on the planet, from the icy arctic tundra to rugged mountain ranges. So, next time you hit the snooze button on your alarm clock, remember the incredible hibernation abilities of bears. Imagine, it's like the ultimate power nap. Bears have an exceptional sense of smell, surpassing even dogs in their olfactory capabilities. One of the most remarkable aspects of a bear's physiology is its superior sensory system. While all their senses contribute to their survival, it's their sense of smell that truly stands out. It's so powerful that it's considered one of the best in the entire animal kingdom. Imagine being able to detect a single drop of blood or a piece of fruit from miles away. That's exactly what a bear can do. Their noses are equipped with about 100 times more scent receptors than humans, allowing them to pick up scents and odors that would be completely undetectable to us. Even within the bear family there are variations. For instance, the black bear is known to have a better sense of smell than its grizzly cousin. A black bear's sense of smell is so keen, it can detect a food source from over 18 miles away. This extraordinary olfactory ability plays a crucial role in a bear's life. It helps them locate food, detect danger, and even find a mate. For a hibernating bear, their sense of smell can help them wake up in time if danger approaches their den. In addition to their bears also have excellent hearing. They can hear the rustle of can hear the rustle of potential prey or the sound of a distant waterfall. Their sight, however, is similar to humans with good color vision but poor depth perception. Yet, it's the sense of smell that truly sets them apart. It's a survival tool, a food locator, and a communication device all rolled into one. This sensory superpower is one of the many things that make bears such fascinating creatures and shows us that there's so much more to learn and appreciate about them. This sense helps them locate food from miles away. Sadly, many bear species are facing threats from habitat loss and climate change. As we venture deeper into the bear world, it's important to acknowledge the conservation status of these captivating creatures. With eight different species roaming the planet, each has its own unique set of challenges when it comes to survival. Across the globe, bears are grappling with the loss of their natural habitats. Deforestation and urban development are pushing bears out of their homes, forcing them to adapt to new environments or perish. But it's not just the loss of land that's threatening these creatures. Many bear species are also victims of illegal hunting for their body parts, which are sought after for traditional medicine or as trophies. Climate change is another alarming concern. Rising temperatures are melting ice caps and altering ecosystems, posing a significant threat to bear species that depend on cold environments to survive. Perhaps the most stark example of this is the polar bear. These arctic giants are perfectly adapted to life on the ice. However, as the planet warms, their icy habitats are melting away at an alarming rate. This has led to a decrease in the availability of their primary food source, seals, which they catch from the edge of the ice. As a result, polar bears are struggling to find enough food to survive. In fact, the situation has become so dire that the polar bear is now classified as a vulnerable species by the International Union for Conservation of Nature. This means that unless we take immediate action to curb climate change and protect their habitats, we risk losing these majestic creatures forever. We need to remember that bears play a vital role in maintaining the balance of their ecosystems. They help control other animal populations and their foraging habits aid in seed dispersal, contributing to the health and diversity of their habitats. While the picture may seem grim, hope is not lost. Conservation efforts are underway worldwide to protect and preserve these incredible creatures. Through a combination of habitat protection, sustainable practices and climate change mitigation efforts, we can help ensure the survival of bears for generations to come. The polar bear, for instance, is now classified as a vulnerable species due to melting Arctic ice. Coexisting with bears can be challenging, but respecting their habitat and understanding bear behavior can help reduce human-bear conflicts. Let's dive a bit deeper into this. You see, bears are creatures of habit. If a bear finds a food source in a particular place, it is likely to return to it. So if we leave our garbage unsecured or leave food out, we're essentially inviting bears into our spaces. 
To avoid this, we need to be mindful of our actions. Securing trash and food sources, for instance, can discourage bears from venturing into human territories. This simple act of respect for their natural behavior can significantly reduce the likelihood of bear-human encounters. But what if you do encounter a bear? Well, understanding their behavior is key. Contrary to popular belief, bears are usually not aggressive. Most often they are just as scared of you as you might be of them. Standing your ground, avoiding direct eye contact and backing away slowly can communicate to the bear that you are not a threat. However, it's important to remember that every bear encounter is unique. The bear's behavior can depend on various factors like the species, whether it's a mother with cubs or if it feels threatened. So, it's crucial to educate ourselves about different bear species and their behaviors. Coexistence also involves understanding and respecting the bear's need for space. Encroaching on their natural habitats for our recreational activities or development often leads to conflict. By advocating for the preservation of these habitats, we can ensure that bears have the space they need to thrive. And lastly, supporting bear conservation efforts can go a long way. Many organizations work tirelessly to protect these magnificent creatures and their habitats. By donating, volunteering, or simply spreading awareness, we can contribute to these efforts and promote peaceful coexistence. Remember respect and understanding are key to coexistence. We share this planet with a myriad of incredible species, and it's up to us to ensure that we do so harmoniously. After all, the world is a much more interesting place with our bear friends in it. Now, let's test your bear knowledge with a quick trivia quiz. Are you ready to put your recall skills to the test? Let's dive into question one. What do bears mostly eat? Do they stick to a carnivorous diet, munching on only meat, perhaps they're herbivores, feasting on only plants? Or do they enjoy a bit of both, making them omnivores? Maybe they're pescatarian, dining on a diet of fish, mull it over. The answer is, they're omnivores. Bears enjoy a varied diet of both meat and plants. On to question two. Which bear is known for its unique diet, eating almost exclusively bamboo? Is it the brown bear, the polar bear, the panda bear, or the black bear? Have you picked your answer? It's the panda bear. Despite belonging to the bear family, these cuddly creatures have a diet that's almost entirely made up of bamboo. Time for question three. How long can bears hibernate without eating or drinking? Is it as short as a week, as long as a month, an impressive three months, or could it be several months? What's your guess? The correct answer is several months. Bears truly are the masters of the power nap, going without food or drink for an extended period during hibernation. So, how did you fare? Did you answer all the questions correctly or did a few bear facts catch you off guard? Don't worry if you didn't get them all right. The fun is in the learning, and there's always more to discover about these fascinating creatures. How did you do? Share your score in the comments below. No matter how many you got right, the important thing is that you're here, learning and having fun with us. Keep that curiosity alive and you'll be a bear expert in no time. Thanks for playing along and learning with us today. We've journeyed through the fascinating world of bears, uncovering surprising facts and shattering misconceptions. It's been a thrilling adventure, and we hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have. But our exploration doesn't have to end here. If you're eager for more, why not hit that like button? It's a simple click for you, but it means the world to us. And if you thought this video was unbearably interesting, don't keep it to yourself. Share it with your friends, your family, anyone who shares your curiosity for the natural world. And remember, our channel is a treasure trove of knowledge just waiting to be discovered. So, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. We're constantly adding new, engaging, fact-filled content, and we wouldn't want you to miss out. Stay curious and see you in the next video.